Today we're going over current NFL players and former NFL players who have relatives, could be kids, could be brothers, could be sons, cousins, that also play football at a high level that you probably didn't know. So without further ado, let's begin. First up we have Cade Warner. Cade Warner is related to Kurt Warner, who is his father, and is arguably the greatest undrafted NFL player ever. Currently Cade is a redshirt junior and starting wide receiver for the University of Nebraska. What's crazy about Cade is that he was listed as a two-star wide receiver out of Arizona, but he had no college offers. And so he actually walked on to Nebraska. As I said, he's now currently starting and under scholarship. Thus far in his college career, he's accounted for 25 catches, 196 yards, and zero touchdowns. Next up, we have Tom Flacco. Obviously, NFL relation to Joe Flacco, who is his brother. Tom is a redshirt senior and starting QB at Towson. He was not highly recruited by any means. In fact, 247 Sports recorded an NA for his ranking as a recruit, and he only had offers to Western Michigan, Coastal Carolina, Delaware, and Temple. He started his career at Western Michigan and also spent some time at Rutgers, although for some reason ESPN had no account of relaying his statistics. As I mentioned, he's currently a redshirt senior and starting QB for Towson. His college stats thus far account for 6,256 total passing yards, 50 touchdowns, 17 interceptions, over 1,400 rushing yards, and 8 rushing touchdowns. Next up, we have Brett Gabbert. Obviously, NFL relation is Blaine Gabbert, who is his brother. He is a sophomore starting QB at Miami of Ohio. He was originally listed as a three-star pro-style quarterback coming out of high school, and obviously among an offer from Miami of Ohio. He also had offers from Central Michigan and a plethora of Ivy League schools. He started in all 14 games at quarterback, named Mac Freshman of the Year, became the first true freshman to start a season opener at quarterback in program history, and threw for a total of over 2,400 yards and 11 touchdowns on his freshman season. Thus far, his total college stats amount to over 2,400 yards, 11 touchdowns, 8 interceptions, and 3 rushing touchdowns. Next up, we have Rashad Lewis, who is the son of Ray Lewis. He's currently a senior listed as an active wide receiver for the University of Kentucky, but is not listed on the Wildcats depth chart. Coming out of high school, he was actually a two-star corner and didn't have many offers. He initially signed with Utah State, was there for a year, and ranks second all-time in school history for receptions at 40 and receiving yards at 476 by a freshman before transferring to Maryland. After seeing out 2017, playing two years, he then transferred to Kentucky to join his brother, who is now a sophomore wide receiver for the Wildcats, and is currently on the University of Kentucky's roster. His college stats thus far account for 43 total receptions, 489 yards, and two touchdowns. He's also rushed for a touchdown while he was attending Utah State. Last but not least, we have Michael Irvin II. His NFL relation, Michael Irving, is his father. He is currently a junior tight end at Florida Atlantic University. Again, he was not highly recruited out of high school, actually was listed as a three-star tight end, and initially committed to the University of Miami. He also had offers from Georgia, Michigan, Texas, and a few others. Well, on Miami, he accounted for 11 receptions, 110 receiving yards, and thus far on FAU, he's only had one reception for five yards. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, I'll probably do a part two. Go ahead and grab whatever is nearest to you and smash the like and subscribe button. Let everyone know in the comments what you use to smash those with, and we'll speak very soon.